and welcome to my channel my name is holly if you're new here welcome back if you're not it is saturday morning well it is saturday at 11 45 so it is barely saturday morning and i just thought i'd pick up the camera today and probably carry it around for the rest of the weekend because i'm having a bit of a kind of busy but chill weekend but i'm excited and as you can see i'm up i'm ready i'm at them because christmas things are beginning to happen today i am gonna go meet up with my friend for lunch um she lives right near a market so we're just gonna pop into that market markets it's not a christmas market at all but markets the whole like just going to get lunch at the market thing it just it gives me good autumn winter vibes i feel like now that all the coffee shops have got all their christmas stuff in like autumn and fall is such a short-lived window in the uk between like summer and it'd be absolutely boiling one month of pumpkin spice things and then it's just christmas for the foreseeable future so today i'm gonna try and hang on to as much autumn fall vibes doing market life with my friend selena and then later on we're actually gonna go christmas bauble hunting so we are particularly going to a next home store maybe a couple of next home stores maybe some other stores but we our intention is to get to a next home store because there are two bauble sets that i've been trying to get online i've been a few bits that she's been looking at that they just have gone out of stock already so we're gonna try and go to a store and see if they have it other random elements of my weekend that are gonna happen are of course laundry because you already know that ish never ends and i have so much clean laundry just literally since it's it's just out of frame right now that i think i might just do a little fold now i also recently relaunched my um baking business so i never actually closed it i just kind of like disappeared off social media um so i still was doing things kind of like on on the slice lie but i had like an auto reply on my emails and i wasn't like advertising or publicizing it at all but i recently returned to the socials um and basically i have an order to do this weekend too that that could be fun we might actually have a little bit of um a little bit of behind the scenes small slice life going on here as well let's just let's just let's just roll with it i am um, actually uncaffeinated despite how joyous i may seem this is literally just i'm running on christmas spirit alone i'm hoping there is an oat vanilla latte in my near future <laughs> just about to leave and then I remembered that we're going shopping for Christmas decorations and the things that are required for Christmas decorations are sometimes measurements so I need to measure just around the sides of this window to basically know because I'm considering putting lights around the window this year and I just remember last year I started decorating and then realized like oh I didn't have this I didn't have that I didn't have this so I just want to be fully prepared measure first before you buy <laughs> scrummy so we're gonna take separate cars i'm gonna take my car so you don't take their car um because they also have furniture and things to get so next stop hopefully christmas bauble land of next home <laughs> Home. Um, with the intention of getting 
well, not these ball balls, the 50 pack of these ball balls. 50 pack is out of stock online and also apparently in store, but I managed to get the 20 pack of the blue, because obviously you know my blue sofa, my blue tree. If you're new here and you haven't seen the tree from last year, then there's a whole video on decorating last year. And obviously this is just gonna be additions to that. But I did manage to get a 50 pack in the pink. So the pink set, obviously like my dining chairs are pink, like my accents are pink, so it's like, blue and pink in here. I don't know if I even said this like in the video, but my tree was practically decorated only on the front and it was against the wall, so you just didn't know. So that's why I was really hoping to get the 50 pack in the in the blue baubles, because then I could like just fill up the tree with like a lot of blue and like it'd be quite dark, but I'm gonna fill up with a lot of pink and it'd be quite bright apparently. So we'll see how that goes. I am cushion addict, but look, mistletoe kisses. Like, it's literally perfect. Navy blue, Christmas, cushion. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. I've been seeing so many TikToks of like, mainly in bedrooms actually, of like, women obsessed with cushions. And it's like, cushion, throw a 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 cushion, and about that much bed left after you've got the cushions on. I'm not that bad in the bedroom, but my living room is a cushion paradise. These were also intentional baubles. They're little like gin bottles. Um, they're also like navy blue. Gin is my drink of choice, closely followed by tequila. So those were 100% coming home with me. I got these two little stags. Um, they're actually like advertised as ring holders, I guess like on here, but I just think they're just gorgeous ornaments because the fact that they're stags, you wouldn't actually know that the prongs were for jewelry and like, I just think they're so nice and they're just mini and cute. I might put them like around my TV. <laughs> I'm laughing because this was not funny at all. But basically last year um, I did Christmas dinner as well. Um, again, there's a video if you haven't seen that. I hosted Christmas in my own home for my family for the very first time. But I was in such a like fluster about doing that and the food and everything. I had got all my presents and stuff in good time and I forgot to buy wrapping paper. And it was Christmas Eve, maybe around 7 or 8 p.m. when I was like, okay, cool, everything I prepped is prepped, turkeys in the fridge, season, everything. Went to wrap my presents, went to get the wrapping paper up, and I'd had like a roll with just like one covering on. And I basically had to wrap presents in the things that, like the packaging that they came ordered in. I ordered a lot of stuff online last year, obviously, because we're in lockdown. So I've got ahead of myself and I bought two five meter rolls of craft paper and these adorable, adorable little um, gingerbread like tags. I prefer to go for craft wrapping paper. I just realized I bought two different ones. Was not my intention, but they are both craft wrapping paper that are recyclable. And if they do unfortunately end up in landfill, then they're biodegradable anyway, because they're just made from recycled paper pulp. So we good. I'm not wrapping Christmas presents in Amazon like, like the innards, the innards of packaging is what my parents and my boyfriend's Christmas presents were wrapped in last Christmas. And that will never happen again. to do on my cake um, for this evening. I'll finish decorating it in the morning. Tomorrow's gonna be another busy day. The White Company, I think I bought something for Eve's birthday from there, or Eve's Christmas. They sent me their catalog gift guide just on the mailer. So I think I'm gonna spend the rest of the evening flicking through this and maybe a little bit of laptop time, maybe catch up on a couple of YouTube videos. And then I'll see you lot in the morning. There are so many 
things happening to me. Like I, I had an accident this week with my hand, yeah. My hand was not in top form. And I was just, my friend's here to pick up the cake and I was just pulling down the, pulling up the blind as she arrived and she looked up from the street and heard the blind come off, hit me in the face, crash bang wallop. And now my whole blind, I can't show you the window because obviously I'll be showing you out the window, but <laughs> the whole blind just landed across my face. I FaceTime my dad and uh, yeah, this is going to be a job for him. <laughs> oh, adulting is just the biggest scam, isn't it? Just the biggest scam. I've got stuff I need to do in here. I was just about to start cleaning the bathroom, um, but I'm going out. I'm sorry, the only thing that can make this day better right now is like a Christmas sandwich, maybe a Christmas hot chocolate or something, because I'm very sad about the situation. My face, I'm probably gonna have a black eye. <laughs> I am shattered. <laughs> this is why I don't know how people be out here doing weekly vlogs because it's a lot. We did some damage, lads. We did some damage. We got our toenails done, which was the most important thing. And my dad has just come and gone and started the revival of the blind situation because it's like a filler, dry, sand, repaint, drill again kind of situation. But it's repairable, so fine. My face hasn't, <laughs> my face hasn't gone purple, so. We can only be grateful. A little situation in, in HomeSense where they were like, oh, we don't have any bubble wrap. And I was like, I've just bought eight mugs. <laughs> How do you want me to get them home? All in all, an excellent little, a little, a little trip around the shops. So I'm not giving up the game on absolutely everything I bought because some things are for future videos and we can cross those Christmassy bridges when we get to them. But things I do want to share because they're just so unbelievably cute. Oh, these gold. Are you serious? I only just recently found out that these are even called gonks. I think they have another name. I think it was like totem or something. But all the ones I've seen, and I'm sure you've seen a lot of them too, are like gray tone or like just typical kind of Christmas red and, red and green. Um, but I found blue ones. Also from Don Elm are these, which are just like little prismed, blue tone, but almost like holographic um, baubles. And they have like a gold top and a gold star. A lot of the things I've got are just 100% definitely navy, but I think these are quite nice and subtle. My mum is actually hosting Christmas dinner. We're going back home for this year, but I will be entertaining over Christmas, no doubt. So I picked up two of these Christmas dishes. Um, these are plastic and they were a pound, or oh, pound 50, sorry. Pound 50 each. They come in gold. I think they also come in green or red. Um, so yeah, these are excellent. Home Sense, the only thing I really have to show you is this candle, which is by Simply Full DW Home. And it's kind of pointless because how, <laughs> it's amazing. Like, <laughs> what else can I, what else can I say? Grab this rucksack. It's upside down. <clears throat> A Levi's rucksack. I don't care for the brand. I was just looking for a rucksack that was very thin, like as in not thin, narrow, that fit the, my work laptop because I, I'm i going into the office kind of ad hoc, but I did it on, I've done it twice now, and I took my like long shot bag and the tube and the shoulders and stuff, it wasn't really working. So I hope this works because it's nice and narrow, so it should sit nice and flat against my back. I don't have a lot to carry and it's got a laptop like pocket inside. So fingers crossed it fits. Oh, these are just so, I can't stop looking at these. <laughs> They're 
so cute and they've got like beanie bums. Last few things I need to hunt for, if they happen, lights are around my living room window um, and perhaps like a green, some kind of like leafy garland for either in front of my TV or to hang down my bookshelf. I still have a few things to do today and I'm now spontaneously meeting my parents for dinner at 6.30. So it's bang on 4.30 right now. Let's say I've got an hour to myself to get a couple more bits done and then I'll get ready for dinner and go meet them. It's like completely dark outside, I can show you the situation that we have here. Adidas tracksuit all day and now I've slipped into my my form my formal Adidas um but I'm gonna go and meet my parents for dinner I will include clips and everything now and probably some more clips the rest of my evening but this is probably gonna be the last time I'm like checking in because I feel like this vlog has been very long lots has happened I'm just glad that I don't have a black hair right now I might in the morning who knows but yeah but thank you for watching this vlog. Stick around for the rest of it. And hopefully the next time you see me, I'll have a blind instead of greaseproof paper.